So how can we distinguish the difference between his own speech and the Quran? What, were, what are the differences between them? Actually, one of the ways of proving that the Quran is not the word of Prophet Muhammad is that, you know what, if, if I find a book that doesn't have a cover and the cover is lost, if I know the author of this book by reading the style of how the book is written, I can tell you, listen, this is the style of Shakespeare. This is probably written by Shakespeare or Charles Dickens or whatever. But Prophet Muhammad, his style is known. It is the Sunnah. It is the thousands of hadith that are narrated. It, this is his style, okay? He learned things, uh, al-hikmah, wisdom, and he gave it to us verbally. This is his style. But the Quran is a completely different style. Any child, uh, any Arab child can tell you the difference between, or any child who knows Arabic, actually to be accurate, can tell you the difference between the Quran and the Sunnah because they, they are completely different styles. No one can talk in a completely different style like that. So the style of Prophet Muhammad is expressed in the Sunnah and the Quran is only by Allah. And the Prophet ﷺ was so truthful to the extent that when Allah told him to tell us something, he said, tell them. قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ Say, he is Allah, the uniquely one. He didn't say, he is Allah, the uniquely one. No, he said, say. So even the imperative verb, the command of Allah was given to us by him because he was so truthful. He doesn't have the right to, to omit one word. And there are things in the Quran that could have been uh, actually omitted if it is his own handiwork.